I love how realistic driving this thing is, like to the skid marks, everything. Oh, let's go deal with this dude, whoever they are. What? There's a very convenient place doorway right there, which is nice, but... Well, yeah. to, you know, stay it. You look like they dropped the body to you. No, the is... Junior's got me trying to hunt up another one in Candy Apple Red. That was the easiest mission possible. My ass. We didn't even have to do much. We might go over for some money. Because I, I don't have the bullets actually to deal with them. Just a matter of time. Black bitch is mine. Hey, you know, there's no need. You know, kill him with kindness. Guys, your leader is dead. Can we just relax? <laughs> oh, shit. Let's keep looking. Ooh, there's a sniper on the roof. I didn't know that. Your time is up, motherfucker. There's an insane sniper on that roof. If it wasn't for this drum. Ooh. Ow. The sniper on the roof mean business. He's going us down. I couldn't get cut off in that. That would have been catastrophic. Dead asshole. Twelve o'clock. Tossing a Molotov. No. I'm ducking down. Now! I got no move here! Alright, do y'all have any weapons? Ooh, you guys do have some really nice cars though. I'll just take that. Um, what else? Is it inside this building? Why would it be inside the building? Just because the sniper was there? Ah, uh -huh, no, there's a ton of money up here. Oh, okay. Well, it was worth the trip. I am sick to death. Whoa. Can I, can I, there's no Y button. Why is Yushi climbed down the ladder button, but it didn't let me climb down? Oh my god. Let's see how good this is. That's eh, alright.
Oh, there's like one right there. Back on a rampage like we never left. We interrupt this program for an important news announcement. If you enjoy Lo-Fi Let's Plays to relax to, subscribe now and never miss a video. There's a new episode every day, so subscribe to get notified for new content. Leave a like if you enjoyed the video and leave a comment below. Thanks for watching. Now back to the episode. Um, you know what? Let's go meet Donovan for some stuff. What? I kind of like talking to him. He's clearly, obviously not a friend, right? But he's clearly a close acquaintance we had during the war in Nam. And like, you develop such a brotherly bond, going through life and death experiences for each other, knowing that that person is always going to be there to cover your butt. So, ma'am. You hungry? Because I just ate. Then I guess I'm good. I could go for some ice cream later on. Yeah, ice cream? sure, I'll keep that in mind. That's crazy. What's this all about? We're meeting a friend at a Cuban restaurant in the French ward. A place called Villa del Mar. I'll fill you in on the way. Let's go. Okay. I think this is a personal request for Donovan as well. Like, it's not, um... This friend we're meeting. Is it someone I know? Nah. Ex-company pal Robert Marshall. Has a line on an asshole we worked with before your time. Man by the name of Connor Aldridge. I remember the name. Two of you had some kind of fallen out. To fall out would suggest there was a time when we were in. You're dragging my ass around town because of him. Something had to go down. Look, all you need to know is that Aldridge is a traitor's cocksucker who got good men killed. And if he's in New Bordeaux, I promise you it's not for the booze and cheap blowjobs. Never is. How cheap are you ever get just... a chance to meet up with? Oh, careful! <laughs> Fired out of it. What was I saying? Oh yeah, you ever get a chance to meet up with that gal you kept going on about? The one with the ass? <laughs> well, they all got asses, but I assume you mean Regine. Regine, yeah, that's the one. So how about it? Nah. I mean, I saw her around, but shit went off the rails. And you know, what about that girl who kept writing you? She seemed cool. Yeah, real cool. Right up until she went and got hitched to an accountant from New York City. Oh. Shit. Sorry, man. I had some friends of mine uh, run a report on him, pulled everything. Seems like a decent enough guy. Oh. He served? <laughs> no. Too assed out. And fuck uh. him. And fuck her too. Thanks, buddy. Aww. I'm glad we like stopped because I really wanted to hear like about their love life. Donovan is wild using CIA services to like find out who he is though. But at least he found out he was a good the dude. Fuck is Marshall. <laughs> Sorry to keep you ladies waiting. Robert Marshall. Johnny Boy and I work together at the company. Excuse me. You got somebody in the trunk? You know, I gave you I a swear, shot to every the game. Seat, you didn't take it. Someone in the trunk. Ooh. <laughs> Ungrateful fuck. <sighs> Sorry about that. No, no Marshall problem. Here's one of New Bordeaux's finest bounty hunters. What? Is that a cattle prod? Works every time. Although it does create a hell of a mess when my skips shit themselves. Well, I keep that in mind. And why are we meeting this man? So what did you learn about Aldridge? Little Bertie told me he's been sniffing around our favorite Cuban bartender, Horatio Balmana. Balmana? Are you sure? Afraid so. If Aldridge is such a big deal, why is he exposing himself over a bartender? Therein lies the question, my dark skinned compadre. Let's go. All right, fine, Balmana. Okay, so this is going down right now. Shit. Oh, uh, wait. I need. <laughs> I have no bullets. I need a supply run out Guys, to the French ward. I have no bullets. I'll hit you away now. I have no bullets. 
I'm in the French war. Think I can stash a little dough? Be there soon. You want something? You let Show me, me know. Show me what you got. No, I'll be I'm just, I'm just, you know, refilling This is done. Room. You know how to find me. You're gonna take off your hand. Where is she? I just wanna deposit my money. Keep this safe. Bonsoir, chère. There we go. Sorry, guys. I'm back. I'll try What did happen here? It looks just like an empty bar. Looks like oh, someone was someone. intent on keeping folks inside. Let's get in there. Jeez. God damn. Oh shit. No more plantains for me. Hello? Anyone here? Why on earth would we call out? Anyone who is here has a weapon, and a weapon enough that to do all is this. Not each night, my head hits the pillow. Know that I am thinking of you, my love. My dreams are filled with images of your body, the sensation of my hands running along your thighs, your hand on me, your lips meeting my lips. You are all I need, and no man, not your father, not Fidel, will keep us apart for much longer. Love, Cheche. Aww. A love letter. He didn't get to send it. I mean, it might be for the best given the circumstances, but don't drink that. Sir, sir, you sick. Feliz cumpleaños from Rosa. Okay. So is was this a very oh, damn? They really just kill, like people who weren't even involved. Today's specials: hamburguesas con queso, con huevo, con huevo. I guess one egg. Sure. Sandwiches picantes. Spicy, spicy, a spicy sad, a spicy Cuban sandwich is two dollars, okay, or is it two dollars extra? I mean, who knows? Chili and lime, chorizo bread, olives, cheese tacos, okay. Um, I think we read all the notes around the area. Are you sure about Marshall? Man seems kind of tilted. Yeah. Tilted. Nah, he's good. Hey, this uh, fella down here is still alive. Oh wait, no, that's uh, that's his brains. Hey, this fella down here's got his brains and his frijoles. Okay, yeah. So maybe he's a little off. A little? Why are we working with him? Is he just good at hunting down people? And we were like, you know, Donovan needed someone under the radar. They clearly drag. Why'd they drag this person? Fucking Aldridge. Amana could be upstairs. Let's go. I'm in front of you, Donovan. Over there. God damn. Meet Horatio Balmana. <sighs> they personally Shit. killed him. They didn't just shoot him. Really? What? It's an Upman. Balmana was a pilot in the Cuban Revolutionary Armed Forces. Back in November 62, the Navy found him and a couple of his pals floating in the Gulf, and they brought him in. Which is where you come in, I suppose. I was already in Nam, but I heard about it. Balmana spilled everything he knew about Castro. We planted a news story about the crew being found dead. And that poor bastard ended up here, tending bar. The way this hand's cut up, Aldridge knows what he's doing. He was trying to get Balmana to talk. You all right? Huh? Yeah, I'm fine. Yeah. I got him. Who is he? Try not to kill this one, Lincoln. What? First of all, can I Don't let that cocksucker get away. Not a chance. Just don't even know where he's going. This is so jank. 
Lincoln, what's the goddamn hold up? Motherfuckers Wiley, doing the best I can here. There we go. We got some questions for you. Hope this was a learning experience for you. Exactly. Bro, you're good. Get out the car. Let you out, give you some space. Why are you still trying to start this car? I swear to God, if I have to, like, after all that, I catch him. You know what? Let me, let me just use my car, his car. Get out. Don't you? All right, let's go. We're going in the shitty little car? Why? Tell me where your boss is. Come here. Oh, Don't kill me, man. Don't kill me. Why the fuck you running? Have you seen you? Fair point. <laughs> Come on. I got someone who wants to talk to you. It's damn good bourbon, huh? Oh, is that an upman you're smoking? Goddamn right it is. <laughs> Moving up in the world. <clears throat> Who the fuck are you guys? Uh, 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 uh. What's your name? Fernando. La gente me llama. Huh? People call me Chucky. You let people call you Chucky? <laughs> Why would you? You know, forget it. There's a dead man upstairs named Balmana. Yes, so? So, the man we're after is the one who shot the living shit out of this place. What's that got to do with me? You're not too bright, are you, Chucky? Oh, fuck! Oh. You're the sole survivor of a goddamn massacre. That's what it's got to do with you. So, tell us what you heard. All right, all right. Dami, the man who came in here, he was asking about a how. A how? Uh, what house? I, I don't know. Balmana refused to say anything, and then he started screaming. Then he gave him a name, Pedro. Pedro Pong. Say it again, so I can hear it. Pedro. Pedro Pong. Jesus Christ. And that was oh! it. Oh, he he another man used with that thing to get the crew to the plane as quickly as possible. That's everything I hear. Oh, my mother. That mean anything to you? Pedro Pond's a code name for a CIA safe house here in the city. Can you keep our pal here on ice back at your place? Sure thing. All right, let's go check out your new digs, princess. Oh. Two of you find yourselves in need of sniper support. Hit me up on the radio. Oh. Adios, Chucky. Oh, we have a cool sniper oh sniper support need a target taken out then contact marshall select the sniper support in the weapons menu select sniper target hold rb oh okay cool so we may not even need you know a full-on sniper no weapon. telling what aldridge is after we need to get to the safe house 
Agreed. The Pedro Pan safe house is located in an old distillery in the southwest corner of the bayou. All right. Well, Let's go. Oh, shit. All right. We got five minutes. All right. Come on, Donovan. This car isn't exactly... Can I... Hang on. Can you get me a new ride in the French wool? I'm slammed at the moment. Give me a ring later on and maybe I can squeeze you in. What? Service feel like oh, I'm unable to exit this one. Okay, so fine. From the looks of that restaurant, Aldrich has some well-trained men working with him. No surprise. Cocksucker was always partial to freelancers. Never could see the appeal of using mercenaries myself. Didn't see you complaining when that Nung MSF battalion saved our asses last year. Those are some mean motherfuckers. Lucky they were on our side. <laughs> Mercs aren't exactly known for being cuddly. Wouldn't last long if they were. Uh, drive faster, faster, faster. Damn it, I left my cigarettes back at the restaurant. Brother, you need to get yourself some loving. Your ass is wound tight. Well, that may be true. The only thing unwinding my ass is a bullet in that motherfucker's head. All right, talk to me. Why the fuck you got such a hard on for this cat? And don't give me any of that traitorous fuck shit. Because while all that may be true, there's something else here. You and me, we've been through a lot of shit together. Shit no one else knows about. Oh, the things we've had to do for our country. Oh, fuck you, man. Don't give me the God and country speech. Save that for the goddamn grunts. My point, Lincoln, is that we share a lot of secrets between us. But we also have a lot to keep to ourselves. Never ask the other. This one stays with me. At least for now. Shit. All right. Fuck it. But I ain't promising to let this go for good. Fine. Oh, poor Donovan. Safe house should be coming up. We're here. Motherfuck! <sighs> There's a way in down here. It's usually guarded, but under the circumstances, we should be okay. What's the layout of this place? The primary offices are outfitted with a mainframe computer system. Whatever Aldridge is here for, it's likely to be located there. God damn it! Oh wow, they really fucked up the CIA's whole shit. And it says there's two green guys in here? Okay. You see what I did to your friend here? <laughs> he cares! And are you going to be the same defiant motherfucker whose brains are going to rain down on this earth? No. Good. Now let's go. God damn it. They're going to kill every last agent if we don't do something. Then let's go stop. Is that him? Is this a subtle operation or no? I don't know what the vibe is. I don't think the vibe can be subtle given the circumstances. This feels very ready to make some looks like they called their friends. Dave, the 
Oh, I can't call my hit squad? That would have been great. Oh, nice job, Donovan. There's a dude on the side there. Was there a guy back here? Oh, there was. Maybe Donovan took care of him. Alright, well, I guess we go down into the creepy-ass basement. And caught some sense. <coughs> oh, God, it's just there. Y'all don't see the dude in this like cream colored suit? Don't stick around. Just go. Thank you. Do they know where to go though? And why are these two left alive? I'm very curious why these two were left alive. What is... Nah. We got more bullets in this baby. Was that a mail room back there? Inspection station. We review every piece of mail leaving and entering the country. How else would we keep an eye on all those common sympathizers? Yeah. What's this? How else? What is this? It's telling me I can't pick it up, but I want to know what it is. Okay. Smart-mouth cocksucker! Going and you just made it harder on yourself, pal. Uh, 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 Aiken shit! Uh, 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 getting low! Who uh, will drive this train uh, all the way uh, to the uh, end? Tossing one in! Reloading! Uh, Got nowhere to go! Clear! Asshole! Looks like the last of them. Good. Well, that was nice and swift. Although, did we kill our buddy? Ah, we might have killed an agent. I mean, was he already going to be dead? Who can say, you know? Hey! Do not touch that. I was not planning to. Who is terrible Spanish? But I mean, can I touch it? Will Donovan be mad? Yes, noventa y dos, cuatro, cuatro. What did you touch? What? Uh, nothing, man. Cero, cero. Goodbye. Goodbye. What the fuck does that mean? Uh, I'm sure it'll be fine. Let's, Let's keep, keep moving. Donovan does not. Oh, you stepped in it now. Found it. Come, Come help me. Getting exactly. down. Can I please just throw like a grenade 
in the general area. I am scared of you. Did y'all shoot Donovan? Oh. Dude, snipe me. I need to get where Donovan is. I don't have any good line of sight. They're gone like last chicken shit, yeah. motherfuckers! I think you got the last one. He's coming this way! Give him a hard step, Sergeant! Got him! Sit on this! Molotov! Tango down! Better drop him! Molotov! Run! Lucky fucker hit me. <laughs> Donovan, are you wary? <laughs> Get in more bullets. Get him down. This is the last moment of your miserable life. Oh, I'll help you. Get him now, your ass out of there. Appreciate it, pal. Oh my god, Donovan can go down. I'm glad I can help him though. Uh, like the last of them. Donovan, baby, you okay? <laughs> what on earth is this? Oh. I assume a grenade launcher. Give yourself an adrenaline shot. Okay, okay. Shit, don't yell. As much as I would love a cute little grenade launcher, um, it has six shots, whereas this w I have 145. So I don't think that's gonna be practical. It'd be very fun. Don't get your gun. Shit. Reloading! I'll put one in his ear! Oh yeah? Looks like the last of them. Alright, we're good. Are we? Are we sure about that? 